Well, don't let me keep you waiting, everybody. Let's go ahead and dive into a game. U-48, the war begins. We're going to jump right in in September 1939 at the port of Willem Shaven, or Willie Shaves, as we like to call it around here. Willie Shaves, as we like to call it. We're going to go with... Um, I'm going to hit Hardcore here. I'll say next there. I don't want to do any crew management at all, so we're going to say no, because dear God... God, am I tired of it. It's just silly. Okay, let's get into the settings here. We're going to keep German just because, well, realistically, the uh, <laughs> the American voice acting in this is just... Eh. Anyway, we're going to have AI... <clears throat> Pardon me. AI difficulty set to hard. Economics set to hard. We're ignoring sailor management altogether, so get the hell out of here. Uh, morale stuff. I guess we're just going to ignore that because we're not really dealing with the crew at all, so to hell with it. I'm going to turn off hard hardcore aiming. I've been talking about it. I'm not saying that I'm never going to use the TDC and stuff, but I'd very much like to experiment with how much effort you have to put into leveling up your officers in order to get them to function properly on their own. So I'm going to turn it off so I have the ability to do both if I really want to. We're going to leave food management off because I don't care. Um, mission completion automatic only if enough fuel that makes sense collision damage is going to be on torpedo flaws realistic let's hide the detection hint we'll do realistic bilge curvature turning off dark and nights because while well, i am streaming this and i'd like you to see something that'd be very hel helpful for you all damage difficulty will max it out at hard is there a no there's no there's no super hard yet um i'm we'll leave the torpedo solution preview on i don't really doesn't really do anything for or against me realistically so we'll just leave it like that kind of a thing all right skip you know the drill my guy okay i think this time we're gonna dress him up you know what i mean okay let's 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 i don't know let's uh uh is this doing anything oh okay i see you have to let go let's let's have a little bit of a stocky skipper what do you say we'll just you know he's not he doesn't hit the gym too often it's fine there's nothing wrong with that let's go ahead and apply that um, I think we could do better. I think we could do better on the clothing. Let's go ahead and... I kind of like the brown half-zip sweater. That's kind of cool. Uh, jeez. <sighs> Battle dress. I mean, ooh, blackjack with a blue shirt. Oh, it's killer. Leather coat, me. Blue leather coat. Come on now. What are we even doing? Uh, disco stew over here. We're going to ignore that. <sighs> Huh? Lumberjack? Lumberjack skipper? I kind of like it. I mean, I was sort of feeling that checkered thing. I really was. I'm not going to lie. Sort of feeling the lumberjack look. Although, that's got kind of a casual... You know what I mean? It's, that's pretty cool. Ooh, turquoise. Not really feeling it. Where's, um... What happened to lumberjack stan or whatever? I, I was, I'm feeling that. I'm feeling the casual red checkered shirt. I'm feeling that hard. Trousers with belt or braces? Ugh, I think we're gonna go with belt. I think belt's the way to go here. I like the idea of him having binoculars. Um, I kind of want a little something more. I'm super digging the sunglasses. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, yeah, we're going with sunglasses. That's gonna happen. That is gonna happen. What do we got for caps? Oh, we could just go with a scully. Visor cap, uh, aviator, I don't think we're going to use the creepy hat. That's creepy, my guy. We're not doing that. I mean, a beanie? <laughs> I kind of, I'm kind of digging the idea of a beanie. I'm not going to lie. Oh, my skipper looks hipster as hell right now. Yeah, gray striped beanie. What? Okay. Beard, heavy stubble, slight stubble. I like slight stubble. I think that looks best. I think we're gonna go with that. Hair color. Uh, ooh, gray. We're going with gray. We're going with gray. Com complexion. I mean, he's got kind of a ruddy look. I kind of like complexion too. Makes him look like he hasn't spent a lot of time in the sub. You know what I mean? Type 13 face. Uh, hmm. 
Hang on now. I'm getting like some Where's Waldo vibes off of this, and I'm kind of, I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of digging it. I don't, I don't hate it. Oh, wait, a type one gives him a sort of approachable. Still, I like the type 13, though. I really do. Okay, Mr. Graf, no. Your name is not Mr. Graf, you silly bugger. Lightly Skipper? No, that doesn't make sense. I was going to say Lightly Skipper, but that doesn't work. Lightly salted it is. I'm in command of this boat. That's me. Mmm, enjoy a drink out of my lovely, lovely, lightly salted entertainment mug. <laughs> hey, rock and roll, baby girl. Ray, yeah, boy. Says they're on a heading of 215. I'll believe that when I see it. I don't think they are. They might not be. We're going to find out. Let's track them for a minute. Okay, yep, yeah, they're heading on 215. So we're going to go like this um, on the surface at maximum warp. And we're going to call in the fact that we've uh, finished the mission. Oh, we're getting a, we're getting some comms too. What's the comms? Convoy in Naval Square and 6... Sorry, 769. Okay. Uh, that's really... That's... Not super helpful, but thank you, I, I guess. Not particularly a helpful thing uh, that they just shared with me, but hey. What are you going to do? All right, we're, go we're going at maximum maximum warp here, so all should be well. We should catch this, no matter where they're hiding. Now, they probably made it, say, this far. There Aha! Good. Perfect, even. Okay, give me somebody on observation, please. Let's turn in. Let's go ahead and call in the fact that we've seen this. Just coming on night now. That's going to work out for us. That looks like an Empire type to me. Alarm, and it's it's showing up as an enemy, which is even better. Okay, we have a British ship. Unknown everythings. I see no reason to be an alarm for a single merchant, so we're going to turn that off. I don't really think that's particularly helpful. And we are going to beeline it for that ship and take them down with the deck gun. Why is this building up? What is this? Oh, right, they're targeting. I didn't turn that off. Ah, I forgot all about that, to tell you the truth. I haven't done that in forever. Okay, so it's got a comms tower. We'll keep the radio remand in case we can um, pick up any transmissions from that ship, I think is best. We are going to worry about the deck gunnerini here. Um, skipper, looks like uh, looks like you're going to have first kick of the deck gun, my guy. Let's get you out on deck, what do you say? Let's grab you a helmet first. They can't shoot back, but hey, orders is orders, you know what I'm saying? There we go. Skipper's got his helmet. Let's head on up top and get ready to engage an enemy transport. Up, 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 up. Boop. Up, 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 up. What's going on up here? I'm a cantankerous old sea captain, and I demand to know what's going on. Where's she at? Dead ahead. Yeah, like it. I, ugh. Jesus, scared the hell out of me. Okay. Just suddenly a gigantic person's head in my vision. It was not good. All right, let's go play with the deck. Let's go play with the deck. Jesus. Why? Why do you hate me so much? What is the deal? Anyway. Let's get some, uh, oh, can I not get any helpers? What's, what's going on there? Oh, I see, there's too many helpers. All right, we'll take them away from you, we'll give them the skipper. I'm gonna have to rejig that. I want, I want to be able to get all the helpers at all times. So that's gonna take some, that's gonna take some doing. There it is, the alarms are going. That's a lovely sound. I like that a lot. Yeah, boy. Loving that mod. Oop. Didn't skip it in. Not very, not very pleased with that. Ha oh, ha. That's a good sound. 
It does sound really deep, right? Good mod. Good mod. Boof. Love it. Slow to two. Yeah. Start laying laying some fire down along the waterline here. Nope. Too low. Yes, Magnet. It is an 88, my guy. It is indeed an 88. Yeah. Give him hell. Give him hell, Skip. Let him know the boat formerly known as the Jolly Roger is here to stay. We're going to make our presence known out here on these seas. Oh, indeed we will. Yeah! I like this mod. It's a good mod. Alright, now that we've got it lit, I'm going to give the order for the skipper to just fire. And we're going to see how well the game can do on its own. Probably not very well. But we did the, the majority of the damage already. Oh. Wow. Good job, Skip. Oh. A little far. Eh. <clears throat> Those were good years. No doubt, my guy. Come on, Skipper. You can do it. We got the f Oh, nice hit, Skip. Got the fires out. Let's do some revamping of our course, please. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Laying the smack down, Skipper is now. Get him, boys. Get him. No, that's the water. Don't shoot the water. Hey, he's all over the place. He'll learn. Hey, good shot, Skip. It's almost like it's designed to hit once and miss once. Hit once and miss once, you know? There, that's a hit. Oh, two hits. Nice. Love it. It's good. It's very good. Oh, repairs are going on. Yeah, light him up. Get him, Skipper. Oh. I see something on the horizon. I certainly do see something on the horizon. Fires on board. We're aware. Good. You. I see something on the horizon behind us. Sure I did. Ah. Whatever it is, is there. But it's graphically bugged. I can't quite see it. Let's take you away from there, and you go there, you go here, you go there. Because I think there's something right over this way. All right. Give him what for, boys. Come on, Skipper. I believe in you. Yeah! And just knowing that you're going to level them up over time, that's interesting. Looks like she has stopped moving. But Skipper is just wasting our rounds into the sea. Like, badly. Still, points for trying. Points for trying, eh, Skip? All you can do is what you can do. Right, boys? All you can do is what you can do. That's lovely. Skipper's lost his helmet, too, interestingly enough. Give it to him, Skip! Come on, you can do this. His helmet blinks in and out of reality. That's pretty cool. Let's see if I can stick the camera on here. Yeah, I can. Yeah! Mmm. I could finish it off with the flak. Yeah, boys. 
Doing the dirty work. Hmm. Oh, what was that? This is cool. It makes it like a movie. I like it. I do. So do two. All right, Skip, let me give you a hand here. Wow, he used basically all of my rounds. I had four, I had like 50 odd rounds or something and they're all gone. There we go, that ought to do it. That ought to do it for the Empire voice. Should be the end of her. Guess we're gonna find, oh, she's not burning. Okay, according to this, she has no uh, health left. Interesting. All right, let me throw in a quick pause here. Tell him not to shoot at boats. Um, get off of this. Let me see the flat gun. I will find out what sound it makes now. Let's see what we got. Uh, I prefer AP. Not bad. Not bad at all. I like it. it. Says here she's dead, but oh wait, I've got um takes a long time to sync mod turned on. That's right too. Forgot about that. Forgot about that. And there definitely is a ship out there. Hundred percent. All right, we're gonna let that just sit for a moment. Um, V, I need the big eyes, because there's something out yeah, forward. Yeah, was that? They said something. I don't know what they said, though. Something... Where are you? Where is it? I can see it. Like, I can... I know it's there, but I can't see it in the binos. It's... Oh. No? Oh! God damn! Sinking overhaul is awesome. She flipped over. This is cool. Yeah, she's sinking. Hell yeah. Yeah, the sounds are very good. First boat of the hopefully long smushing of boats. Boats. All right. Send that back. Interactions. Take everybody on board that we can. Get paid as much money as possible. That's going to be important. And those guys cannot come with us, but we can give them some supplies. This is. We'll give them fish. Would you like some fish? You may have them. You are welcome. Did I just give them all 50 fish? Is that a thing? Did I just do that? Because it didn't ask me how many. Roly. Did we just give them 50 fish? No, there's still 40 fish. Uh, that was weird. Anyway, I think it's fine. Cool. Okay. Now, where was that target? I thought it was a target. I thought it was out here somewhere. Let's head in this direction for the time being. Uh, maybe this way. All right. See if we catch sight of something here. Aha! There is something out here. Okay, Skipper, go about your business. Uh, same with UV. Everybody just do whatever it is you're programmed to do, please. 0 0.2 meters of water in the boat. That's not a problem. Let's jump on the radio, call in the fact that we can see what's going on. Juggle the crew around because I gotta fix that. It's annoying. But we are closing in on a something. I think we're going to be doing a submerged attack. I think that's going to be next for us. We're going to test out the crew's ability to uh, get their own solutions, I think. It's probably not great at the same time. It's probably not super terrible. Plus, I've got new books. Huh? Got new books to play with? This is going to be mint. We are going to have fun. There shall be fun. Okay, blue lighting, still waiting, still waiting, good, blue lighting engaged. 
Clear the decks. Move to periscope depth. Periscope depth die. Yeah, let's test out some let's test out some stuff. Hell yeah, V. Hell yeah. So with the um overhauled sinking physics, we are gonna have to make sure that we don't unduly waste ammunition. Because normally I just keep firing until I'm sure they're going to go down. But now, like, it'll already be dead, but it's going to take forever for it to um, sink. So, yes, we're going to be warming torpedoes as well. Skipper, I would like you to be on the observation scope. And we're going to get Wheelchair Willy here on the big ears. Yeah... And we're going to get Roly to warm up a T1 torpedo to the forward. I can give him one helper, one helper. Okay. Yeah, I've got to rejig that because uh, they're making it basically impossible to do my job with only so many helpers at a time. Uh, we're doing nine knots to their probable seven, so I think this is fine. Close enough to get a solution started. My mic, uh, my mic went poof. Sorry about that. Sorry, everybody. Sorry about that. Mostly I was just talking about this new book. Um, the fact that you can choose the countries and then you can choose the boats, whether it be civilian, military, etc. I think that's incredibly cool. That's a cool mod. That is a cool mod. All right. We can get everybody in except Skipper. Skipper's got no sight yet. What's up, Skip? Can't see? What's the matter, my dude? Oh, right, I can't move this one up. Uh-huh. What are you saying you can't see? I can see for you. You bugger. Now, is it added? All three are added. Okay. So, we're going to begin gathering information here now, I think, as I recall. I haven't used that in forever. Let's go continue warming torpedoes. Um, Let's get to... Two warmed up, I guess. Started on that, maintenance-wise, our electric torpedo friend. Since we have the uh, realism set high, we'll warm two just in case. Possibly three. We'll find out. All right, let's see how we're doing on our... All right, we got 1% of the solution. Let's slow to three and head directly this way. Give ourselves a lovely, lovely 90 degree. Can I do anything else for anyone else? I don't think I can. I don't want to take the helper away from him. I don't want to take the helper away from him. I don't really need this helper because we're not firing for a while. So that should be fine. Um, supposedly with the mod I've got, they're going to stay warm for one hour. I'm assuming that means one in-game hour, but who knows. So, it's got 1% worth so far. Um, it's very slowly climbing. Very slowly. So, with any luck, um, it will figure some stuff out. They're giving it 237.9 uh, for a course. That more or less checks out. Um, 163, 169. It's interesting to watch it change over time. Get a notification when the enemy ship is sinking, or do you get the message when the ship is below the surface? Uh, I, I got an indication while it was still on the surface. Um, your mileage may vary. Let's say that. Alright, we've got 96% worth of our solution. I'd like to take a look at our friend here. All right, we've got the uh, SS Orkla, the SS Orkla, Orkla, 98% solution, 191.3, feels a little, yeah, I mean 180, 190, yeah, that's pretty close, that's pretty damn close, oh, she's going to have a real bad day, you're not wrong. All right. I wish I could get the uh, percentage to show up on that screen. That would be very helpful. 
I'm pretty sure 99% of a solution is the is all you can... I don't know if this ever turns to 100, to tell you the truth. So that being said, let's slow down to speed 1 and pretend like we're actually doing this for realsies. Let's take away the helpers for him. I don't think he needs it. I don't think V needs it either. Yeah, we're good. Norway. Yes, it is Norway. It is Norway. You're not wrong. I wonder, is that going to change uh, my book? Canada, German, France, United Kingdom, Greece, Italy, Nor Norway. Bell, Tower, same boat. It's all good. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Let's take the shot from the attack periscope, as is the way it's supposed to go. Um, we've got almost a nice 90 on this so far. We're saying they're doing 190.8 degrees at 2169. That looks about right to me. Yeah. We do have a 100% solution, so that is a thing. No shoot. Damn, that's right. She's not in the war yet, is she? That's right. Crap. <clears throat> well, that ends the uh, the hopeful uh, torpedoing. It's no longer going to happen. We'll shoot fire. Displeased. I am displeased. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. We're going to have to go inspect her. You'd have to go inspector. <clears throat> Anyone actually use star shells? Many times, yes. If you're playing with darkest nights enabled and you get an actual dark night with no moon, star shells can be one of the only ways to see your targets. But unfortunately, they've got them modeled uh, pretty imperfectly because they don't, they don't, they they go too fast to actually light up the targets very well. Like you'd be better off with some kind of a para flare, obviously. But also, super fun note. If you fire a star shell at a ship or a plane, it bounces off. Yeah. Yeah, it's fun. All right. All engines to zero. All engines zero. I right. interact. Delegation. Let's send them. All right. We're going to be sending... Who's my other uh, uh, Spanish speaker? Roly's going to head on over. Uh, let's get um, V over there. And what do you say Wheelchair Willie has a, has a go? We're going to bring some crew with us. We don't have a gun. That's unfortunate. But uh, maybe we, our, our numbers will be enough. Maybe our numbers will be enough. Okay, speaking German. All right. Let's, uh, let's see your papers, my guy. So she's heading to London carrying food. Uh, the, chip, the ship is trading with block-eyed allied ports. And it's a fair prize for me to sink it. Well, sounds good. Let me search your cargo hold, please. I wish to know if there's anything cool I can steal. We're going to be sinking this boat, baby. Yeah, we could... Ah, I mean, we could torp it. It's just going to be sitting there dead in the water, though. I feel like that's kind of a waste, realistically. Let's not torp it. Let's just sink it with the flat gun or something. I want my first modded torpedo to, to be a proper shot. Maybe they carry deck gun shells, because I think we've only got like six or seven left, so. I want to hear the torp uh, sound effects too, but I'm in command of the boat. Takes forever to transport, but it's loot. It is loot. Loot is loot. What do we got? Let's see what you got. I mean, food that we can... Oh, apparently we can't steal any of the food. Right, because I've got food turned off. Never mind then. Okay. Evacuate your ship, sir. They have evacuated their ship. All right, let us engage a course towards said ship. Speed two, speed two, all right. Um, let's go ahead, sorry, we gotta get closer to the lifeboats to do this piece. Please, okay, what the hell was that? That just froze, it just stuck. Okay, now, skipper, here. Um, let's see what we got left in the, uh, God damn it, Skipper. I swear to God. Just do, do what I think I want you to do, not what you're actually doing. 
How about that? We got left for, for deck rounds. Five, six, something like that. Six rounds. Six damn rounds. All right, we got to free up some bodies. Uh, oh, no, Skipper's already got them. That's cool. All right, we'll get closer. We don't want to waste these six shells. Interactions nearby. Good. Uh, we can give them supplies. We'll give them some uh, canned potato, uh, canned bread. There you go, my guy. Enjoy. They're tasty and delicious. Have your canned bread, please. There you go. Huh? And bread for you too. We are the nice people. Let's let's all remember this. Uh, yes, feels good. Yes. Uh, believe it or not, folks, I have indeed sunk a couple boats. <laughs> I've even sunk boats with just a flat gun. I've sunk boats by evacuating the forward and just ramming them for the hell of it. Okay, not too shabby. I do love the sound of this gun. It's a very nice sound. Very nice sound. Fortunately, all we've got is HE. There we go. Skipping him in. That's the best way. Hard to do. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Show me your teeth. Show me your teeth. There it is. Nice and low. Excuse me, gentlemen. You're going to have to move. Yeah. Get him. All right. Come alongside. Speed one. Oh, that's it. Red ammo there. All right, Skipper. Stop the boat. Let's, um... There's no way to, for me to order him off of that for some strange reason. That's cool. Uh, Skipper, come up here. We're going to use the flat gun. Use that there, flat gun, baby. Yeah, boy. Um, let's see. Radio up, please, to your station. Skipper's moving. I think we just let Skipper go ham, to tell you the truth. I really do. We're just going to give him the command to use the flat gun and just let him go, I think, is going to be best. Alright, so there's the ship. There's the Skipper on the gun. I'm going to pause here. Let's see if they will uh, do the do. Set up for a little bit of a... little bit of a how, how she going kind of a thing. And... Give it to him, Skip. Um, Skipper. Skipper. Well, I mean, that didn't work out, did it? All right, fine. Got to do a job, do it your damn self, I guess. All right, AP ammo. Water line, baby. All right, we got to try to, like, judge this as well, because we will not get the indication that she's sinking. I think it's already dead, to tell you the truth. Yeah, it's just slowly going down. That's what's going on. Oh, that is a shot and a half right there. Right? That looks amazing. That boat is uh, flipping. Slowly, but surely. <laughs> Forgot to take the provision. 100%, my guy. Skipper, you're pointing the wrong way. What are you doing? What are you... You're ruining my shot, Skipper. Dink. Look that way. That's lovely. I like it. That ship is rolling. It's slow, but it's it's distinct. I like the new sinking... Uh, I like the sinking mod thing. It's cool. Let me just sort of... Yeah. Oh, that's lovely. That's cool right there. Slowly turning on its own axis. Taking on water. To tell you the truth, I think we probably had her sunk with the, uh, the six deck rounds. <clears throat> but, who knows? Who is to know? It is fairly dramatic, you're not wrong. And it's the kind of drama that I don't mind to see, to tell you the truth. I think it's great. Yep, just slowly taking on water. It's very cool. I'm surprised for a mod how much detail stays in the ship. Like even like the, the tip of that spar there, you can see like the... 
you know, the jankiness of the metal and stuff. It's very cool. It's very, very cool. Yeah, this is cool. Always left a lifeboat behind. Don't you think you might want that? Just saying. Just saying. Could come in handy, that uh, lifeboat. Oh, yeah, here she goes. Just taking on more and more water. That's so cool. I still haven't given the note the notice that she's gone down. I'm gonna leave the uh, the UI on just so I can hear them say it. Yeah, this is gonna bring a whole new level of difficulty to the game because you're never gonna know if you got the ship sunk or not, right? It is still losing altitude, right? think so. Yeah, that bollard's going under. It's turning. Oh, hell. Wait, it's turning. Uh, crap. <laughs> it's, uh, it's gonna fall on me. I don't, I don't want that to be a thing. Please don't fall down on me. I beg of you. Yeah. Oh, and the death roll. Blub, blub, blub. Blub, 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 everybody. Still hasn't given the indication that she's sinking, though. <laughs> Alright, I've got the indication on the target card it's sinking, but no one has said the words, the ship is sinking yet. So, I don't really know what to say about that. Maybe we should keep it in sight for the time being. Turn us about. Messages. So no one's actually said it. It says down here that it is sinking. But no one actually said the words. It's interesting. See, I don't want to leave because in this game, if you don't witness the ship going down, you don't get the points for it. And I would certainly like the points for the thing I spent literally all my ammunition on. That would be helpful. Oh, still going. Wow. Talk about a mod. Like, that overhauls the crap out of it. Right? It's still sort of sticking out of the water. It's amazing. I'm impressed. I am impressed. All right, let's get a little touch of the 140. will go down, right? Like it's technically gone. Right? Oh, it sort of flipped itself back up. Oh, there's only 31 meters of water under the damn boat. It's probably sitting on the bottom. Oh no, it's not quite. It's got a little space. It's fine. It said two reports. I'm going to assume that one of them was things sunk. We're going to find out because we're going to do the uh, return to port now. That'll tell me. That will tell me what's going on. This is the German Coast Guard. What are you thinking about? I love that little thing. That's so much fun to watch. I laughed at... Oh! They're very pleased with us today. They're giving us a little celebration for coming home. Oh yeah, don't, don't send her the gun. You look stupid. Now we look dumb. Maybe it was spotted and sinking. Who knows? I don't know. I don't know. We're, we're going to find out, because I'll, I'll get it in my, uh, my summary. All right, some points for V. Good job, V. And I get points because I'm better than all of you. I, I even get a medal. I'm just saying, I get a medal. Uh, I get two medals because... You know why. You know why. Okay. Okay, first patrol down. Fantastic. Pivotal time in history. Love it. Very good. So the voice was the first one we tucked down. She was carrying food from Bergen to London. 5,984 tons. So we had all of our tonnage with that first ship. And there's the Orcla, the one we just sunk. Um, 4,148 tons, transporting food from Bergen to London, registered in Norway. Fantastic stuff. Good.
So, we didn't get to fire a single torpedo. We had it teed up, ready to go, and one of you was kind enough to remind me that the target in question was actually a neutral target. And uh, I'm just used to shooting at the Norwegian ships. So, thank God. Thank God for you, chat. So, the new mods are okay. Um, I'm enjoying it. I have a special place in my heart for the, the sound mod I'm using. It sounds very, very cool. Um, I especially like the sound of the 88. I'm very much looking forward to shooting a torpedo. Um, allowing the skipper to fire the rounds. Now, he went through basically all of my ammo, but to be fair, I wasn't paying attention to the ship, right? If I had paid attention to the ship to the point where it had lost all of its uh, life bar, it was already in the process of sinking. But due to the sinking physics overhaul mod I've got, they sink very, very slowly. So you don't get that immediate, hey, the ship is sinking, right? So that's more on me than it is on, <clears throat> uh, on the game's aiming, even though, of course, they were pretty terrible at it. But still, he scored a fair amount of hits. He scored more hits than I thought he was going to. I would say it's something in the tune of like <clears throat> maybe 30% accuracy, something like that. Um, however, that will go up in time as I upgrade my officers. So that's sort of the way I want to play this. That's the way I want to do this playthrough. See what kind of power the upgrades to your officers will give you, right? So we're going to find that out. So yeah, that was our first kick the can with our brand new boat, with our brand new mods and our brand new understanding of how the world works. Um, unfortunately, skull flag mod worked when we started the game, but then it disappeared about 10 minutes into the game. I may disable it and then re-enable re it and see if that brings it back. Try the camel mod. Um, I'm not super big on mods that just make pretty colors on the outside, to tell you the truth. It's just an additional uh, workload on a GPU that I don't particularly care for. Um, I, I really can't see myself using a skin mod like that, to be perfectly honest. Does that mean I, I won't ever? Hard to say, but realistically, I don't see it in the foreseeable future. How about that? Yes, there's also a mod that makes it all rusty. There's 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 literally hundreds of mods. That's why I don't bother with the skin ones because look, I lived in the time of the Winamp generation, and if you don't know what Winamp is, I'm not gonna tell you because you don't need to know. And uh <clears throat> you could spend hours reskinning your player. So the concept of reskinning the outside of what is supposed to be a still steel hull, I'm just good. I'm just gonna leave it to tell you the truth. I'm fine with that. Mod with the salted logo. That would be cool, but I don't know people, I, I don't know very many people who build mods, so yeah. Is there a mod that makes a sub yellow? Not as far as I know. Winamp and my internet station days. 100% my guy, right? Way back in the day. All right, folks, listen, it has been a slice. Thank you so very kindly for your attention, for your applause, for your booze, for your generosity. Uh, and mostly just hanging out with me on a Tuesday. Uh, I know a lot of, a lot more people are playing U-Boat these days, and, you know, you've got your pick of streams, and uh, you chose mine, and I appreciate you very much for it. Uh, that's that's what the streaming is all about, uh, a community. If you're not a member of the Discord, uh, please consider swinging by. Um, it is a wonderful, magical place, and I would love to, to be able to greet you there. I'll throw out my, so, my socials yet again. If you're not checking me out on YouTube, do me a solid... Watch a video to video or two, it might be your thing. And hey, likes and comments, they the algorithm algorithm loves them, which you know I would love too. So uh, you know, if you could do me that favor, I'd appreciate it. I also make TikToks if you don't have that much of a um attention span. <laughs> Mostly because I got kids and that's a thing. So there you go. All right, folks, listen, that's gonna do it for me. Uh pre again, appreciate your time. Um until next time. That's, that's the time that's coming Thursday, by the way. Uh, yeah, so until next time, I have been Lightly Salted. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. I know. <laughs>